Hi guys, thanks for tuning in to another episode of Nuggets News. In today's video, I want to clearly explain how to set up the Ecomi Secure Wallet. Now, this is a hardware wallet device. It safely stores your private key and your cryptocurrency offline. In the future, they've got plans to add those collectibles and safely store data in the vault and all that sort of thing. So it's all going to be controlled from the one card, which is fantastic. Now, make sure you buy that from one of their reputable retailers. You don't want to be buying hardware devices of any kind, you know, off eBay secondhand or anything like that, guys. It's just too much of a security risk. So once you've got it, you can make sure that that tamper-proof seal uh, hasn't been tampered with at all. And let's uh, get into the unboxing. So the first thing we're going to pull out is the recovery card. Now that is going to ask you to write down that 12 word seed phrase when we set up any sort of cryptocurrency wallet. You're probably familiar with that by now. And we've also just got the user manual there as well. The next thing we're going to pull out um, from the little box here guys is the actual card itself. Now hopefully that focuses there you're gonna see a little digital display that little red button is actually a physical button and then we have the little charging pins down the bottom but all this guys is the size of a credit card now this is what I love about this device you know we're hearing of people getting their digital devices taken off them at airports and so on you know this is a very um, you know sneaky simplistic Put this in your wallet, no one's gonna know what that is and you can safely store crypto, collectibles, all that stuff that I mentioned before. So the next thing we wanna do there is press that little red button to turn it on. Once we turn it on, that digital display is gonna fire up and say hello and then please pair. Okay, so the next stage here guys is to download that Akomi Secure Wallet from your app store and install that. So our Secure Wallet is gonna search for our card and it's found it there already guys. Click on done, that's now pairing the device. Okay, this stage is gonna bring up a little pin number on the digital display of the card and you just wanna type that in so it knows that you've paired with the right device. That's a six digit uh, pin number. If you are having any issues with pairing the card in this stage guys, press that red button and hold it down and just turn the card off and back on again, get in and out of the app and just click connect again and that should be finished pairing. It was gonna ask you to press that red button one more time and now pairing is complete. All right, now at this stage guys, it's gonna say paired on the card display and it's gonna ask you if you wanna create a new wallet or recover. Now, if you've already created a hardware wallet in the past, or an Ecomi wallet and you've lost it, this is when those 12 word backup seed cards come in handy so you can uh, recover your wallet. But in this instance, we just wanna create a new wallet. Now this is gonna ask us to write down that seed phrase. Now, you're probably familiar with those 12 seed words. Ecomi actually is gonna display 12 numbers for you to write down. And at that stage, you just wanna grab your pen or pencil and uh, write that down in order on that card. Guys, at this stage, I just wanna tick the little box. Yes, I've written down my recovery seed and click next. Now, this is gonna ask you to enter some of those recovery seed numbers to make sure we've written it down correctly. So, enter the first one, one. Once you've typed in your backup phrases correctly, those numbers, it's gonna create a wallet for you. Now, that's a progress bar. It's gonna take a few minutes this is creating wallets for um, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, Bitcoin Cash. They've got plans to integrate more and more currencies in the future, guys, all from this one uh, backup and for your one card. So again, it's so important to do this stuff thoroughly and store that in a very safe place. If someone finds that backup uh, card of yours, they can recover your wallet and access your funds. Alrighty, that's all good to go. So let's click on go to my wallet. So as I said before guys, Bitcoin, Bitcoin Cash, Ethereum, Ripple and Litecoin and there's that Ecomi um, token coming soon as well. So watch that interview if you want more information about all those features and how that's going to work. But that's all set up now guys. Um, have a play around with it. Now guys, once we are in the app there, we can click on anything we want. Click on that Bitcoin wallet. You're probably familiar with these send and receives and the addresses and all those basics of how you can use this just like any other wallet now that it's set up. If you do wanna send funds, guys, click on send. That's gonna ask you to scan a QR code or paste in an address if you have one. The secure feature about this is it's gonna only confirm that transaction and sign it with your private key 
if you physically click that red button. So that is what makes this so secure. So finally guys, on the little digital display there, you can cycle through your wallet addresses just by pushing that little red button. It's gonna take you through all those there. So guys, that's it. We've now paired our hardware wallet with our phone app. We're now free to send and receive cryptocurrency to any of those addresses in that wallet, in that app, as we would any other wallet. I hope you found that tutorial nice and easy to follow. Please hit like, subscribe if you haven't already, share these videos around, and thanks for tuning in, guys. Cheers.